Tamil Nadu Governor R. N. Ravi has dismissed Senthil Balaji, a minister who is accused of graft in multiple cases and is currently being probed by the Enforcement Directorate as well, saying that his continuing in the cabinet uh, could lead uh, to some kind of uh, constitutional breakdown due to the due process of law, including a fair investigation, not being completed. Now, this is something that has riled up the DMK because this issue had come out in the public domain as well. They are saying that it is clearly a case of constitutional overreach. No such action has ever happened in other states before is what the DMK says. One will have to see, of course, what the final fallout of this is because all of this is happening at a very interesting time. It's happening at a time where opposition parties attempted to come together in Patna, fault lines within opposition parties also. We're talking about AAP and Congress, we're talking about TMC and Congress itself, or we're talking about BRS and recent comments made by KTR linking the Congress's first family to Italy, whether all of that is showing some fault lines within the Congress party. At a time when such fault lines have come out, will events like this galvanize the opposition? Can it potentially bring these parties together? And can they actually work together and fight the Lok Sabha 2024 together? That's going to be our prime debate on the News R agenda at 10 this evening. Do join us.